with a spine who would work your mouth against this match. Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. It is a stadium that has a feel very much of its own. I'm talking, of course, of Craven Cottage. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's France against the United States. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Here's the side France will go with. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Here's how it looks for the United States. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. And now they get the ball rolling. Toletti, Matteo, she's made a really important challenge, Perisse, this attack looks highly promising, and a goal to open the scoring, a very bright start to this one. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. And a throw-in for the United States. Could cross it in here. Makes the move to the inside. This could square the game. And that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point. And momentum is with them. Well, here's the goal again. And what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top quality goal. So back underway following the equaliser. Selma Basha. Clara Matteo. Lavelle. Good movement, but the danger averted for now. Dali, Matteo, on to Catoto.
High quality defending. Oh, and a perfect ball now. How about this? Rose Lavelle. Is she going to score? So near, but wide. Toletti. Griezmann. Dali. France looking dangerous here. Well, the keeper wasn't worried in the slightest. Done. Committed challenge. Wendy Vanar. Oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. And she scored! It's gone in, and now she can run off and celebrate. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Trying to really get at the opposition here. And making the move to the inside. Terrific block. Blocks again. Horan. Mallory Pugh. Space on the flank. And the keeper more than equal to it. And over it comes. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Kadijatu Jani. A foul, but advantage played. An unforced error, you've got to say. Promising sequence. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Well, the supporters think it's on. Spot on with that tackle. Tonetti. Griezmann. Ev Perisse. And a good looking ball. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Well, France have had all the ball in the last 15 minutes, and some of their play has been really good. And if they continue to control the ball, as they're doing at the moment, I'm sure they get that equaliser. Can she find the right pass? Doing well to keep possession. Free kick awarded then by the referee.
Morgan. Pugh. Oh, that's a fine pass. Can she connect with a teammate? And able to get a body in the way. A gift for any goalkeeper. Sophia Smith. Well, she keeps moving. Morgan! What a save! And the referee's whistle. We're officially at the halfway mark here in West London. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Will it be? Still possibilities. And she puts it away. Just what they wanted to see from her. Well, I have to say, the keeper's done really well on the first shot, as you can see, but it's gone straight to an opponent and nothing she can do about the second strike. And time for the change now. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Coletti. France moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? from the keeper fantastic stop trying to pick out a teammate and still dangerous might be able to get in behind the defence could pull one back here and every player's worst nightmare because this will go down as an own goal. Well, as the replay shows, it takes a deflection. And as a result, the keeper had very little chance there. They just got a bit of luck. And the game has been restarted. 3-2 here. Pew. Well, she's playing with a purpose. Now can she pick out a teammate? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Kadijatu Jani. Now can they counter clinically? Jani. Now, who can she pick out? Oh, there it is! Unbelievable stuff from two down. They're right back in this. Well, here it is. Head down, hit through the ball and get it on target. That's a top-class finish. There was no stopping that. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. 30 minutes to go then. Huerta, Smith, 
Now with Morgan. And getting the better of a marker. Opportunity. And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Well, how about this? 4-3. Sandy Toletti. Majri. And Renard. Well, good-looking play with the ball of defeat. A glorious chance. They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. And level again here. This has been quite the roller coaster ride. Well, this is a really good game of football. Both sides have played well going forward. There's been plenty of chances, goals, and a lot of near misses. It's been great entertainment. Yes, I mean, they're matching each other. At and there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Well, here it is again. What a good build-up this is. Quick, incisive passing, clever movement, and all done at pace, which led to a simple finish. That's a real joy to watch. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Timely intervention. And a good-looking ball. Oh, body in the way, crucially. Well, an opportunity for France, perhaps, to make it look even better. Played over. Well, still an issue here. Renard, able to get a body in the way. Sofia Huerta, are getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Gayogo, oh, a perfectly timed pass. Oh, she's made the move. Blocked it brilliantly. Giving it a try. Constantly thwarted. Done. Alex Morgan. Beautifully disguised ball. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Can they hit on the break? them to breathe a bit more easily well let's have another look because this is a goal they have thoroughly deserved they've played really well so far
Kenza Dali. Teammates available. Crossing into the middle. Needs to clear it away. Five minutes to go. There's a slide rule pass. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Cleared away comprehensively. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? And it might be. And a fine stop. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Playing it in. There it is! Victory more or less guaranteed now. Well, here it is again. And you have to say, it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Wendy Venard deciding to give it to the keeper and there goes the final whistle and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome you're absolutely right Derek their attacking play was excellent full of energy and pace and the midfield completely dominated the game it was a great all-round performance